From the Apoco Studios in Oklahoma City, you're watching an OSU update. I'm Jenny Carlson. Oklahoma State heads to Kansas State this weekend for a huge game against the second-rated Wildcats. John Helsley joins us on the phone. And John, as we do every week at this point, let's talk about three things to watch heading into this weekend's game. What is at the top of your list this week? Well, at the top of my list, interestingly enough, is Oklahoma State's offense. And how will they approach Kansas State's outstanding defense? Will they try and hit them with a lot of passes? A couple of weeks ago, Mike Gundy said he wanted to throw it 50 times against Iowa State. Will they try and you know, go at it with a heavy dose of Joseph Randall? You know, will they mix it up? It's, it's going to be very interesting because I think the Cowboys are going to have to score a decent amount of points in this game. Yeah, definitely against that K-State offense, 55 points from K-State in their last two games. All right, what else is on your list? What's next on things to watch? Well, number two then will be how will they handle Colin Klein? Uh, didn't do a great job of that a year ago. What are they going to do to try and slow him down in the run game? He's an improved passer. Um, it presents so many problems, as everyone has figured out. Um, you know, nobody yet has really found a way to slow him down. What do the Cowboys have up their sleeve? Uh, maybe some blitzes, some different sorts of run blitzes. They're going to have to slow him down, number one, I think, in, in the run game without giving up too much in the back end of the defense. Okay, so the Oklahoma State offense has got to bring it. The Oklahoma State defense has got to bring it. What's number three on your list? Well, it's kind of a familiar question of late, and that is who among the wide receiver core is kind of going to be that guy this week. You know, without Tracy Moore, uh, with Isaiah Anderson apparently still slowed by uh, a you know, finger injury. They, they, they need someone. Lately, that's been Josh Stewart. You know, is he still the guy? Uh, can Charlie Moore get free? You know, who else is out there? Is Isaiah maybe healthy enough to, to do some things this week? They're going to have to have some big plays in the passing game. It'll be interesting to see who they go to to try and provide that. All right, Cowboys and Wildcats kick off at 7 o'clock. It's ABC, it's primetime, and it's national. Be sure to stay with the best coverage team anywhere at newsok.com and every day in the Oklahoma.